the Carolina Panthers at the Houston Texans. This is the Thursday night football game. Texans are a seven and a half point dog. Panthers, like I mentioned, number one total DVOA in the league. Texans missing Tyrod Taylor, so they're going to be starting a rookie quarterback in Davis Mills, who, okay, like he was, he's all right, I guess. We'll see, but you got a short week, and yes, the Panthers do have to travel on a short week. I get that, but man, seven and a half, like give me the Panthers all day. Like Sam Darnold actually looks like a competent quarterback right now, And I don't know that I would have, even against that schedule, with the Saints and the Jets, knowing what we knew, I didn't expect him to come out and look like he has. I I think I'm going to roll with the Panthers here. Minus seven and a half. What's uh, what's your thoughts here? Yep, that's the answer. Davis Mills isn't good. This defense is really, really good. And uh, uh, they're just going to have a hard time to to score the football. What they were doing against the Browns, listen, Tyrod Taylor is a gosh dang professional quarterback. He's a professional football player, okay? And nobody thought that they would be as good as they were this year in the the way they looked the first two games. And that was all because of Tyrod. The second Tyrod went down, it's over. This team cannot move the football. Let let me tell you how bad it was last week against Cleveland, okay? okay? Tyrod Taylor goes down. And these guys, these guys get a third. It's, they run a play on third down, it's third and ten. They get it to the eight yard line. All right. So now it's third. It's going to be fourth and two, or they can take a penalty to back the Browns up even or to, to go backwards. Whatever. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> they get they get a penalty. They, they, their option is. Fourth and two, I'm trying to play it in my head to remember it. Those options were either fourth and two or third and ten, okay? Yes. So the penalty gives them another shot. At yeah, yeah it, was an off, it was an offsides penalty on the Browns, so they could either— It was an offside penalty, yeah. but I was trying to figure out why it was still third and ten, because they were already backed up uh, five yards. That's why. The, if the math wasn't working in my head. The Browns shouldn't have been able to get them third and ten if they had offsides. It was third and ten. Or fourth and two. They took the fourth and two and punted. Yes. And and Kevin Stefanski's reaction to it was oh, priceless. Yeah. Priceless. Well, he was a shock. <laughs> he, was a, he didn't know what he's doing. He's, he's thinking, this is when seven, Kevin Stefanski has reached, like, Bill Belichick, get out of mind control. You know how <laughs> Bill just stands on the other side of the field and coaches just do dumb stuff and just give him the ball and give him extra possessions or give him points? Like, that's what I saw here. Yeah. I thought it was insane. I didn't know what I was watching. I'm still discombobulated. I remember the play. I don't remember all the details of it. I just don't – I don't know why you do that other than look how bad our offense is. Look, 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 look who we're playing. We need field position and hope that we can score on defense and special teams because we're not, we're not moving the football in this Browns team anymore. And I just thought that was crazy. No, I'm, so, I'm with you. No. I'm with I you. Think, and, and the Panthers, I'm going to tell you this. Panthers defense, hell of a lot better than my Brownies defense. Hell, this defense is good, baby. They are really, really good. Yes, they are. So we are both riding Panthers minus seven and a half. Thanks for listening to the Winning Cures Everything podcast. The website is winningcureseverything.com. And if you want to connect with us, we're on Twitter at GaryWCE, at ChrisBGiannini, at Winning Cures, or you can email us, Gary at winningcureseverything.com or Chris at winningcureseverything.com. Subscribe everywhere you need to subscribe, and we'll see you soon.